Sunset and a cup still waiting to be presented because the Camogie final was the longest and most exciting ever to be played in Australia. This goal for Queensland finally settled a contest that went to not one but two periods of extra time. It was draining and emotional, especially for the baby of the team, a 17-year-old who moved out from Clonakilty two years ago. I know I always loved Camogie, but once I came out here, I felt like I like I had to keep it. Like it was, it just reminded me so much of home, and it was just me. Like it was a part of me, and I just couldn't lose it. And being able to play it out here is like I'm lucky because there's some people that can't like they're in different places in Australia that and they can't play and I'm just blessed that I I have the chance to play with such a good group of girls. Another Cork woman was on target for Victoria Regina Curtin a former All-Ireland winner in both camogie and football now on the losing side to Western Australia in the plate final but taking a wider view of the occasion. We lost, yeah. I mean, like we're all competitive and we're in the game to win it. But uh, you know, the last three days have been a really enjoyable experience. You know, it's it's really different playing camogie out here. It's the standard is still really high, but it's it's played at a really sort of an enjoyable atmosphere. And you're meeting players from your own clubs and counties at home, and then you're meeting players from other counties as well. So it's almost like a meet and greet, and you meet people that you haven't met in a few years, and you're like, oh, you're in Australia too. So. It's great to catch up with old friends and old faces, so we've thoroughly enjoyed the, the three days despite losing this morning, yeah. The day's other final was in minor football. Two teams made up mostly of homegrown Australians. South Australia in red from Adelaide and Victoria in black. They put on a hugely enjoyable showpiece with open football the order of the day. And the cup going to a proud captain with roots in the Rebel County. Ah, oh, well, I mean, come down this Gaelic Park all my life, really, and um, been playing this for four years. It's absolute it means the world to me. I mean, so I've wanted most of my life, really, to be captain and to take our team to victory. And, yeah, did that, so I'm very happy.